Welcome to Tech Solutions. In this tutorial, we're addressing a common issue that arises when running virtual machines on VMware Workstation 17 on Windows 11. On your screens, you can see we've installed Debian 13 as a virtual machine. However, when we try to power it on, we're greeted with the error message. Module disk power on failed and failed to start the virtual machine. This error can be frustrating, but the good news is that the solution is simple and quick. The problem occurs because VMware creates temporary files, called lockfiles.lck, in the virtual machine's configuration directory. These files are intended to prevent simultaneous access to the VM, but can sometimes remain after an improper shutdown or system crash, leading to this error. Let's fix it! To resolve this issue, you need to locate the folder where your virtual machine's files are stored. Open the directory and look for unneeded files with the .lck extension. These files are no longer required, so delete them. Once done, try powering on the virtual machine again. The error is gone and your virtual machine is running smoothly without any interruptions. Stay tuned for more tutorials, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more helpful tips from Tech Solutions.